Good afternoon, I'm Sean Preble and you're watching Mediaplex Live at One. Windsor police are seeking suspects after an armed robbery. Police say the Max Milk on Wyandotte Street East and Lozon was held up by two males around 2.30 this morning. One male carried a long gun and the other a handgun. One suspect is described as wearing a beige jacket, dark pants and a black toque. Police say the second suspect has a blue and black jacket with a black hood and dark pants. Retirement didn't last long for one area politician. Former Windsor Tecumseh MP Joe Comartin will teach at the University of Windsor starting in January. Comartin will discuss the problems he sees with the voting system and democratic processes at the federal level. He'll also share his experiences in the House of Commons. Comartin says students may get to work with him and other faculty members on published research papers. Also recognizing that I have limitations, I'm, you know, I may not be seeing all of the, the perspectives and so bringing in additional people who hopefully have strong opinions of their own, uh, you can hammer out some of the best solutions for the, for the country. Winter may not be here today, but it's bound to hit eventually. When it does, police want you to be ready. Kayla Wong reports. Local police are taking time to remind drivers of the cold weather approaching. Constable Andrew Jeweler of the Windsor Police Service offers these safe driving tapes for cold weather. Make sure their vehicles are prepared, like they have the appropriate tires, winter tires, or their tires have enough tread to drive safely, and to also clear ice from the windshields. It's also important for them to leave more time in getting to their destination, drive a little bit more slowly. Reporting for Mediaplex News, I'm Kayla Wong. In weather, overnight there will be a chance of showers with a low of 7. More rain tomorrow and a high of 9. Thanks for tuning in. I'm Sean Preble and you've been watching Mediaplex Live at 1.